Do you ever skip breakfast and then a few hours later, instead of feeling foggy, you suddenly feel super sharp? Like your brain just switched into high gear? What if I told you that's not your imagination and you've just unlocked your brain's secret power source? For decades, we've been told that glucose, sugar, is the only thing our brain runs on. It's like the premium unleaded for our noggin. But that's only half the story. Our bodies have this incredible built-in backup generator, and this backup fuel might actually be better. It's called ketones, so what are they? Think of ketones as little energy nuggets your liver makes from fat. This happens when you're fasting or when you cut way back on carbs. You know, the keto diet. Your body goes, all right, not much sugar coming in, time to burn some fat. And boom, ketones are created. Now here's the cool part. Most people think ketones are just a last resort emergency fuel. But in a state of ketosis, your brain isn't just surviving. It can actually get up to 60% of its total energy from these ketones. It prefers them. Why? Well, let's talk about glucose for a second. While it's a good fuel, having too much of it can be messy. Ever heard of glycation? It's basically what happens when excess sugar molecules get sticky and start glomming onto proteins and fats in your body. It's like cellular rust. Over time, this rusting process contributes to aging and can damage our brain cells. Ketones, on the other hand, are what you might call a clean burn. Imagine you're trying to heat a room. Glucose is like a smoky, crackling bonfire. It works, but it creates a lot of soot and sparks. Ketones are like a modern, clean burning stove. They produce far less oxidative stress, which is a major driver of brain aging. They even help protect and support our mitochondria, the tiny power plants inside our cells. It's a more stable, efficient, and cleaner source of energy. This becomes incredibly important as we get older. One of the unfortunate realities of aging is that our brain's ability to use glucose for energy starts to decline. It's like the fuel line gets a bit clogged. But guess what doesn't decline? The brain's ability to slurp up and use ketones. It remains just as strong. This might be a key reason why ketones are being studied for protecting against age-related cognitive decline. So that feeling of mental clarity you get when you're fasting or on a low-carb diet, that's likely your brain happily sipping on ketones. Now, it's all about balance. I'm not talking about the extreme dangerous state of ketoacidosis that can happen in uncontrolled diabetes. I'm talking about mild nutritional ketosis, a natural state our ancestors were probably in all the time. So the next time you feel that clear-headed focus, remember, you're not just running on empty. You've just switched over to nature's favorite brain snack. You're burning clean.